Well, the law provides for me to give a declaration in regards to how many ballots have been counted, um, how many for yes, and how many for no. So in terms of the certificate that I will be um, preparing, that will be the information on it. But yes, we will have information by um, electoral divisions. Um, and so that information, again, we will be having a media center. And I want to invite the media, who you, you all will be able to come to that media center on the night of the 8th. That will be at the um, Biltmore. Whereby, as the results are coming in, the information and the results will be unofficial. The information will be coming in from the returning officers to us. We will be verifying that information and putting up at different intervals as we get those throughout the night. Because it's a national issue, and yes, it's the first of its kind, whereby um, it's a standalone referendum. But I basically believe that it's just for the public to understand this is not a general election as such. It is not something by constituency. This is overall. It is for the entire country of Belize. So we're not able to say which constituency is winning for yes or which one for no, that does not determine the results. It's a simple majority overall in the entire country of Belize. Can you share with us uh, any <coughs> figures as such in respect of the overall voters vote? Well, um, so far we're still um, in revision period. The revision ends um, actually today. But um, so basically we have a little over 148,500 persons. Um, we're still ensuring that we don't have persons registering more than once because we need to remove all those from the list, but the list is approximately 148,500, which is necessarily, and I know you'll ask the question, 72.4% um, of the previous register that we had before re-registration.